To create your first estimate here in FreshBooks, make sure that you are in the Estimates section. And I'm just in the subsection that is also called Estimates. To create my first estimate, I'm going to go ahead and click the New Estimate button up here at the top right. Notice the trend as we've been using FreshBooks. When we're in a particular section, if we want to create a new item in that section, there's always this same green button up here at the right corner so you know where it is and it's very easy to use. So I'm just going to click New Estimate. And you'll notice that this looks almost exactly the same as an invoice. And it's done that way on purpose because the idea is that once you create this estimate and the client approves it, you can then do the work that you need to do on the project and turn this estimate directly into an invoice without having to enter all the information a second time. So I'm going to fill this out just like I would an invoice. I'm going to pick my client, John Doe, the date issued of the estimate. And I can go ahead and I can add some tasks. I'm just going to add research task and I'm going to say project two research for this task. This will give my client an idea of how much this is going to cost them. So again, we'll go with the rate of $30 an hour and we'll say that this is only gonna take us about three hours. So we can see the total would be $90. Again, if you need to add taxes, you can do that here as well. That will give the client an idea of the taxes that they're gonna to have to pay if that is applicable to this specific project. If we had specific items associated with this estimate, we could also add them, again, just like an invoice. Down here in the terms section, we can enter the terms for the estimate. So we could say, here is the estimated cost of the research project. And then we could go ahead and we could send this by email or save it as a draft. So generally, you're probably going to send this to your client. I'm going to just save it as a draft for now. When we do that, it'll take us back to the estimate, just like it does when we create an invoice. But if we want to see this estimate in list view, we can click on the estimates section here. And you'll see here's our first estimate for company ABC. It gives the description and the total that will be due if the estimate is accepted and the project is completed. You can see down here, our estimate is currently in the draft status, but if we sent that estimate or if it was viewed or accepted, the client can actually log in and, and hit accept on an estimate, which lets you know that you're ready to go on a project. It would say so over here in the status section. and You can look at the different statuses available for your estimates down here at the bottom. Stay tuned for the next video where I show you how to turn an estimate into an invoice.